Hello everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and in this video I'm going to show you how you can convert the text in a PDF to actual text format and reserve the formatting, so bold, italics, the font, all of that sort of thing, on a Mac computer running OS X. Now there's actually a built-in application on Mac called Automator and we can build our own little app, which really isn't that complicated, that will allow us to extract the text from a PDF document and then we can paste that text into Microsoft Word or Pages or whatever word processing program that we're going to use. Now I do want to mention that this will not extract images from your PDF files. If you want to extract images, you're going to have to use a different application and before I actually show you how to use Automator, I just want to show you real quick two of the options you have for fully converting PDFs, including text and images. There's a free program online that you can use, and it's here, let me pull it up. It's actually called Zamzar, Zamzar, however you want to pronounce that. And all you have to do is upload your file, choose the format that you want to convert it to, and then enter your email address, and it will send you a link to download your converted file. Now, I have a resume on my desktop here. It's an old resume from 2013, and I actually tried using the Zamzar app with this resume. It does convert all the text, and it brings in the images, but all the formatting's messed up. In fact, on the top part of the page here, all the text is not there, but all of these lines and images and areas to put text are here, and then only on the second page do you start to see the text. So honestly, in my opinion, it didn't work. It almost made it more of a hassle than it was to begin with. But you can try that out if you have a document, a PDF that's only text, doesn't have much formatting and images, Zamzar might work for you. The other application that you might want to try is actually a professional application. It costs money. It's called Solid Documents. You can buy it for Mac OS X and it does a really good job of converting PDFs into pages format or word format and keeping all of that formatting and all the images within the document. But let's take a look at how we can use Automator just to get that formatted text from a PDF. So again, I have this PDF here on my desktop. That's the one that we're going to convert into a text document. So to get started, we need to open up Automator on our Mac computer. I'm going to do that just by searching Spotlight. I'm going to click on Spotlight and I'm going to search for Automator. And you'll notice that it comes up in my list and I'm just going to click to open Automator. Now it's asking me where I want to save my project. I can just choose to save it on the desktop. So I'm going to hit Done. And I'm going to go up to File and I'm going to hit New. You might have seen this screen when you first opened Automator, but I've been playing around with it a little bit today, so I wasn't at the initial opening screen. This is what the screen should look like. And when the screen comes up, what we're going to do is we're going to create a workflow. So we're going to click Choose right here. There's a lot of things we can do with Automator, so try not to get distracted by all of the options you have in here. And if you just follow along with what I do in the video, you should be able to convert your PDF documents into text format. So we need to create our own application. And to do that, we need to drag some of these actions over here on the left over to the right. So what we're going to do is, first of all, we're going to click on Files and Folders over here on the left. And then this option that says Ask Finder for Items, we're going to drag that option over here to the right. Now, on the left side of our screen, we're going to click on PDFs, and we're going to choose Extract PDF Text. And you're going to drag that over here to the right, just below the Ask for Finder item. So we have these two items over here on the right. Now what we want to do is when it says Output, we want to change this to Rich Text. We want all of the formatting in our text to be preserved when we convert it into a text document from a PDF. You can choose where you want the file to be saved to once you convert it. We can keep that as the desktop for now. And we can choose the same name as the input name. So it's just going to have the exact same name as the document, but instead of .pdf, it's going to be .rtf for a rich text file. Now this is our application. So what we want to do is we actually want to save this application. So I'm going to go up to File, and I'm going to click Save. And I'm just going to save it on my desktop. And I'm going to call it, we, we want to make sure that the file format is application, not workflow. So make sure you change that first. And go ahead and call it whatever is descriptive for you. I'm going to call it PDF to Text Converter. And I'm going to click Save. Now we can go ahead and we can quit out of Automator. So I'm going to go up to Automator and I'm going to quit. On my desktop, I now have my app, the PDF to Text Converter app. I'm going to double click on the app. It's going to ask me to select a file because we told it we want Finder to ask us a file to convert. So I have this PDF file here on my desktop that I want to convert. So I'm going to click Choose on that. It's going to go through its process and you can see automatically I now have a rich text file here on my desktop. So let's take a look at these two files. If I open up this PDF in preview, 
here's what it looks like. It's an old resume, but you can see I've got you know my employment history, all that on here. It's pretty nicely formatted. I'm just going to quit out of preview. So that's what it looks like in preview. Now the rich text file doesn't have any of the images, but it does have all of the formatting. So you can see the bold, uh, you can see the bulleted lists, you can see all of the formatting in here. Now I could go ahead and I could copy all of this information here. Let's say I go up to right about here. So I'm just going to Command C to copy. Then I could open up an application such as Pages. I could, uh, oops, let's, open, let's create a new document here in Pages. We'll just say a blank document. And now I could paste all of this text into Pages. And I have retained all of my formatting. I could go ahead and I could start spacing this out a little and, and changing it however I want. But we were able to convert text from a PDF into text format and retain all of that formatting with a free application on our Mac OS X computer called Automator. Again, if you're looking to convert your entire PDF, including images, you're going to have to look for a third-party program. It's really not that easy to do to convert text from a PDF into a text document because essentially a PDF is just an image. So you have to have a very powerful program that can go in and read an image and extract text and turn it into actual text on a computer. So it's not as simple as it may seem, but there are third-party applications that do do it. Again, the free one is Zamzar and then the paid one is solid documents, but Automator works great if you're just trying to get that text. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. And if you wanna see more technology tips and tutorials, remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for today. This is Anson from AnsonAlex.com.